Hi family, welcome once again to Simmer's Healthy Recipes. So today's recipe is mango coconut and banana coconut ice cream. This healthy, rich, creamy frozen food can be eaten as a snack or a dessert for the family. Trust me, this is healthy for the children and also for adults. Everyone will love it. Let's get started. So I have with me some dry coconuts and fresh mango. I have some bananas. I also have condensed milk, custard, some flavor, evaporated milk, so to begin with I'll take out the coconut plum from the hacks. So I'll go ahead and wash the coconut plum and also my fresh mangoes. So now that our coconut plump and mango has been washed nicely, I'll go ahead and grate the coconut. So this shredded coconut can be used for desiccated coconut. Desiccated coconut is basically the shredded coconut dried up with its sweetness still intact and it can be used for bread, for biscuits and so many other things. I'll be sharing those recipes later. So after I'm done grating, I'll go ahead and blend my coconut plum. So I use less water in blending this because I want my coconut milk to be thick. So I'll go ahead and sieve the milk from the coconut plum. And we now have so our this can be used milk. for baking, for your pancakes, for your porridges, or such as rice pudding, so many things. So this is our coconut plum. Let's call it unsweetened coconut plum because the sweetness has been taken from me. So this is what I use for my coconut pancake. But in a dried form. So you can check out the coconut pancake recipe in the description box. So I'll go ahead and then cut my mangoes into pieces. So this banana was in the fridge, hence the change in color you see. 
now on fire in a pan i'll add one cup of custard to water and bring it to a boil so i'll continue to stir regularly to avoid it being lumpy so the custard is getting thickened and at this point it's very thick so i'll go ahead and then add water bit by bit to loosen it But I do not want my custard to be so light, so I minimize the water, and this is the consistency I'm going for. So now I'll divide my coconut milk into two, and to one part I'll add half of the custard as well. To so that I'll add my condensed milk evaporated milk stir very well and then go ahead and add my banana puri so i mix everything together until it is well combined and to that i'll add one teaspoon of vanilla flavor So our uh, coconut banana ice cream is ready and I'll go ahead and pour them into my cups. So you can even have this as a smoothie, it tastes so delicious. I'll go ahead and put in my steaks so I can easily remove them when it's ready. Now to the add up coconut milk, I'll add the remaining custard. Give it a good stir. And to that I'll add my condensed milk. Evaporated milk. And also a uh, mango puree. So to this I added flavor as well. So I'll give it a very good stir until everything is combined and our mango coconut ice cream is also ready. So you can also have this as a smoothie and it's perfect. So I'll go ahead and pour my mango coconut ice cream into my cups, add the steaks and then refrigerate both the mango coconut and banana coconut ice cream for 24 hours. So it's been 24 hours and a healthy snack or dessert is ready. So to easily remove it, I'll dip it inside a bowl of water and then it comes out easily. And voila, our ice cream is ready. If today is your first time watching, please subscribe, like and share so you can try this recipe and give me a feedback in the comment section. Remember the greatest wealth is health. Have a great day. Bye.